Hello and welcome everyone. I have a very exciting and very informative video for you to really address your questions when it comes to test results. So go ahead and watch this whole entire video and let's go ahead and get started. So what does herpes IgG positive mean? So a lot of you don't really know a lot of this information I'm going to share with you. So please pay attention and watch this whole entire video and it will really help you. So a positive result strongly suggests a recent or past HSV infection. The person may be capable of transmitting the virus to others. I know a lot of you actually know this. So this is nothing new. A small percentage of positive HSV2 IgG results may be false positive and I'm going to get into that here in a moment of why so further testing may be appropriate for patients with a low or unexpected positive HSV2 IgG result how accurate are blood tests for herpes the accurate herpes blood tests detect IgG antibodies Unlike IgM or IgG, I, the IgG antibodies can accurately be broken down to either HSV1 or HSV2. However, since most cases of genital herpes are caused by HSV2, a positive result for type 2 antibodies most likely indicates genital herpes. So remember... IgG tests are more accurate, but not without their own issues. So for example, an IgG test can distinguish between HSV1 and HSV2, but the problem is that it takes time for the antibodies to be able to be detected, and this will vary from person to person. So physicians recommend waiting 12 to 16 weeks after possible exposure. So if you do this within two months, that's not going to help, and you're going to get a false negative. Wait at least four months is my suggestion. The magnitude of the index value is not indicative of the amount of antibody present in the patient sample. So what this means is that the higher the index value does not mean higher antibodies. There is a misconception out there that the higher the index value, the higher the antibodies. And that is not true at all. If you have a positive result, this indicates the presence of detectable IgG antibodies to HSV2. If you have a negative result, this means that it's unable to confirm the presence of IgG antibodies to HSV2. Recommend, recommended testing in two to four weeks. So it's highly suggested to get tested again even if you went from positive to negative and I've been telling people this for a long time for this reason also never get a test once again for the first four months once you think you have been infected always wait a minimum of four months if you have a negative test get another one in two to four weeks if you're still negative and you were positive before then now you are officially negative Hope this information helps all of you. I appreciate, uh, once again, you watching this video and continue to move forward. Thank you so much, everyone. Bye-bye.